Hi guys, Silver for Fun here. What this video is going to be about is different types of silver coin or silver collecting. As you can see, not everything's coins, but um, I mainly stick to coins. Now, it depends on the sort of things that you want to collect. I collect a bit of everything, but main, mainly coins and... Um, I have sort of your, your normal pre uh, euro coins and then I have bullion and then I've got a few different shapes so we'll start off we'll start off with this I mean this is this is poured silver this is the only poured silver that I've got so this is one troy ounce as it says there um, that's the symbol for the silver forum this was from 2017 and I have showed this on one of my videos before when I first received it uh, it's number so these were all stamped with a number so when it actually decides to focus in number 883 I think if I remember rightly these well these were made by backyard bullion uh, if you haven't seen his channel which I'm sure pretty much anybody that has seen my channel would have seen his because he's got absolutely loads, thousands of people compared to my couple of hundred. Um, but Backyard Bullion decided to uh, make some poured silver coins. Uh, sorry, it's poured silver. Uh, I'm pretty certain he did a thousand on the first run. Is it a thousand or was it a hundred? Must have been a thousand. Thousand, yeah, because this is uh, 883. Um, as you can see, it's got all his swirls. This, this is what he's known for uh, for the swirls in the in the silver. Camera's not picking up very well, actually, but uh, it is pretty nice. It has done. Um, other poured silver special um, silver forum uh, bars since but that's the only one that I've got uh, I'm not really into poured silver as such but uh, I just wanted one just for the just for the, the fact of, of getting one then again I've, I've shown these on my on my channel before these are the collection for the uh, route 66 so these are the shields the the road map or the road highway shields or the road signs I should say uh, I've only got two of these up to now I do believe the third one is out now um, but I've not actually seen one in the UK yet um, but I'm, I'm pretty certain I've seen a video with with someone showing the third one in the range this is the Missouri Gateway Arch so that's another shape coin that we can get. And you can get silver bars. I've not got many silver bars. I think I've got about three, three or four. Again, I'm not really into these either. These don't really rock my boat. It's more coins for me. But uh, I mean, put down in the comments what you what you prefer. You might uh, only collect. This sort of stuff or this sort of stuff or commemorative sort of silver different shapes or colored coins I don't really collect colored coins either oh this has got quite a nice picture on it I mean it's, um, it's got a snake it's from 2013 one ounce there's a Rand refinery so I'm assuming it's from South Africa and then we've got bullion coins so these are a few Britannias this is probably one of my favorite Britannias which is the oriental border 
This is a really nice coin. This was from earlier on this year. Um, as you can see, it's 999 silver. So that's 999 silver. And this as well, I think, is 999 silver. Let me just have a look. I think that's 999 silver as well. Yeah, 999 silver, fine silver. Okay. This is hallmarked. And I can't see the hallmark because it's just. I think it's just the assay and backyard bullion. BYB, and then I think it's the Edinburgh assay. Um, so, yeah, so we've got some, some different coins. Twenty seventeen, twenty eighteen. What have we got here? Twenty seventeen. And yeah, I am handling. I do. I do touch some of my coins. If they're bullion, it doesn't really matter. So this twenty eighteen. So this is another twenty eighteen. It's different to that twenty eighteen. And what else have we got? 2014, very milky look. As you can see, I'm touching it. Getting lots and lots of finger grease all over it. Lovely. That's 2014. What have we got now? Another 2014. 2018 Oriental border. So there's some of the other coins that you can collect. And then if you don't really want to stretch to 999 silver, you can collect just normal coins, and these are reasonably cheap. Um, you know, let's just put these all over here out of the way. Again, I've shown all these coins before. Coming up to Christmas, I don't really want to spend lots of money on uh, on coins. I'd rather spend them on my kids. So here we go, 50 francs, one of my favourite ones. Do love French coins. Sorry about the light, it's very, very bright. I can't turn it down. So this one, I say it's 50 franc, and this is a 0.900 silver. So it's 90% silver this is. So these are pretty much 100%. And this is 90%. And this is 30 grams, a 30 gram coin, whereas one ounce, one troy ounce is uh, 31 point something grams. And what we got next, we've got a thousand escudos. Now this is 50% um, silver. I do like this coin, it's very nice. Look at the dancers. A really big coin. Is it as big as that one? Oh, it's actually smaller. Very, very minutely smaller than the, uh, the 50 franc. But if you want to compare it to one troy ounce Britannia. It's very slightly smaller, but look at the thickness. Look at that thickness. And then the last one that I've got here 
is a five Deutschmark, 1951. I've got quite a few Deutschmarks. I mean, if you look at some of my videos, I've got quite a lot of commemorative Deutschmarks. This particular one is 625 silver. So 62.5% silver. Uh, this is an 11.5, sorry, 11.2 gram coin. And the old near uh, Skudos, I think I forgot to say, was uh, 27 grams. So, yeah, that's a different, a few different sort of coins that I collect. Or different types of silver that I collect. I think it's interesting just to um, mix it up a bit. Don't collect all the same sort of things. Have a little bit of variation. Um, if you're just going to your safe and you've just got hundreds of these, I think it looks a bit, a little bit boring. You might be collecting for weight, but it, it's a, it's not the prettiest thing to look at. It's nice to look at variation, different types of, different types of coins, different from different countries. I love to see different countries and different cultures. I love, to, I mean, for instance, I mean, look at that. That's 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 just full of culture. That coin, it's depicting if you can see it because of the light so you can see their their dancers they look like if it was if that was in britain they'll be like morris dancers we'd call them morris dancers but it's obviously traditional portuguese dancing or dancers um so it just shows what their life was like probably in the 70s or 80s or 50s or, or whatever it's nice. Anyway, that's enough of me rumbling, and we'll see you next time. Uh, if you want to put down in the comments what sort of silver you collect, whether you collect poured silver or just normal coins, or even not silver but silver-looking coins, you know, like fifty pences, you know, whatever rocks your boat is is cool, really. Um, These just a, a small selection of uh, of what I like to collect. So we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Hit that uh, like button. And uh, we'll see you next time. Cheers. Bye.